What's going on guys? Welcome back. So we're on this bridge. We just defeated our uh, our friends. Well, three of them. One of them was actually actually out training in some important place. So we're going to head over this way. We're going to probably arrive in Snowbell City. So freaking finally. What are you What are you ladies looking so similar for? I don't know why, but I really only remember the battles I lose. You've got to turn every frustrating defeat into motivation and grow stronger. You should tell that to her. That's what I'm saying. Well, you look important. My Bergmite was given to me by my grandpa, grandma, when I was born. Sweet. Thanks for the info. So this is Snowbell City. It's all of a sudden winter. Over that way, it's like completely summer. But now it's, now it's nice and nice and snowy, and I like it. I'm gonna go ahead and visit the old Poke Center. Might as well give a nice heal. Pokemon are a little bit hurting from that last match. And now we are all good. So let's go ahead and explore around this place. Let's see what Snowbell City's all about. And holy shit, there's a fat Obama Snow chilling here. Holy crap. Someone just left their Obama Snow ch chilling there? Check out this house. It's happening. For generations, my family's duty has been to teach moves to Pokemon that people call mythical. I can teach a move to Keldeo or Meloetta. Well then. I know where to come back when I get those bitches. You! Try this! Obtain TM08 for bulk up. Thanks, lady. To raise attack stat and defense stat. Why, why are you talking like that? I don't have it, but the thick fat ability weakens the power of fire and ice type moves. I told you I don't have it. Sure you do, fatso. <laughs> What's going on, bro? Lissandra, he's my old friend. He's trying to help people in need. Coming can... Convinced of people's stupidity and facing his own limitations has led him to conclude that the world could not be saved, which led to his suffering. It's ironic. <laughs> it is indeed. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and cruise to the neighbor's house. All these houses are pretty damn nice. Pokemon don't freeze in harsh sunlight. Well, that's pretty. That's cool. You go ahead and use Sunny Day and never have to worry about freeze hacks. Standing here reminds me of a cold region far away. Would you listen to the first song I composed there? Yes. Cool. Cool. Can we go ahead and get the hell out of here. And, uh, I wanna slide down that shit. So here's the gym in the middle. This place looks pretty crazy. What's new, little blue? But ain't the future champ. Hate to disappoint, but the gym leader is actually out right now. He said he was off to the winding woods if you like searching. Well, we gotta go to the winding woods apparently to find the gym leader to battle him. Thanks to the cold air that seeps out of the gym, no one in this town needs air conditioning. All this snow is coming from the gym? What is this? That's crazy. You and your Pokemon look like you've been through a lot together. You know, I've got a kid who's right around the same age as you. She just set, she just set off from Bennonville Town on a journey of her own recently. I bet she's looking all grown up now. Indeed. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, cruise up in here, Lady with a Meryl. It doesn't matter whether I go somewhere or not, because as long as I'm with Pokemon, I can have fun wherever I am. Of course, of course. Can your Pokemon use Map Block? Mm, what? what? The hell are you talking about, bro? You didn't even let me answer either. Oh, we're gonna go over this way. We go. We got a nice little, nice little bridge. Okay. Sweet house over here. What are you, what are you little, little people doing? We're well known for using Synchronize because you're twins. I see, I see. Let's trade my Bishar for a Jigglypuff. How about no? It's like the fucking worst trade ever, trying to scam people over here. When Pokemon get frozen, they can't do anything. It's hard to freeze a Pokemon. Not if you're battling me. If you're battling me, it's real easy to freeze me. Just use Ice Beam, almost guarantee you'll freeze me every time. That's just how, no, I'm just kidding you, but that, that would be, that'd be, that'd be awful. Hail, Traveler, what sides have you seen with your Pokemon? Too many. So, so over here's a new route. We're gonna go ahead and save that for later though. We'll go through here. Oh, another Obama Snow. What's going on? Your little Obama Snow buddies all the way over there. Go find him. Oh shit, we got a nice little clothing store over here. This is, this is Jill. Just shoes. That's my style. We need socks anyway. We'll go ahead and go in this... You know, we might as well go in this fitting room. Check out what kind of sick new threads this place has got. So for the hat department, they got a camo hat. That's pretty, uh... I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna go ahead and not buy that. How do I, how do I like, take the hat off? The fuck? I don't want that hat. Damn it! Didn't mean to try it on. 
Shit on my life. Gotta go back in here. Yeah, this place doesn't look like they have too good of hats. Yeah, no, no hat selection unless you want a camo hat, but that's that's lame. For the hoodies, holy crap, this hoodie has a Pokeball on the back of it. Oh my god, I need that. Splatter paint t-shirt. That's kind of cool. Another another splatter paint t-shirt, it's red. Zip jacket, and it's about everything. You know what, I'm gonna, I'm gonna definitely get... I want this t-shirt, although, I'm sorry character, we're in the freaking snow right now, but you're gonna have to wear a t-shirt, so we got some new pants, I'm gonna pick up these fresh black ones, hell yeah, looking more emo by the minute, <laughs> so we got some, some same same socks, some new sneakers, oh alright, those are, those are pretty fresh, some blue ones, even some boots, I have these red ones on, you know what, I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get these ones, those look pretty sweet. And all right, new bag, two-tone bag. Oh shit! I want to get the back black one because then I'll just look too emo. Oh shit! Can I? I can get a button on my freaking hat? No way! You gotta be shitting me! I'm definitely getting it. Actually, that looks that looks pretty freaking lame. Let me get the sunglasses instead. All right. So let's change into all our new shit. And all right, so we're looking pretty sweet. Paint on my t-shirt and everything. Wow, they look great on you. You have three items and that'll be eighteen thousand dollars. All right, sounds good. And we just uh, we just picked up some new shit, so that's cool. Thank you, Snowbell City freaking clothing store. So I'm guessing. Uh, okay, we got a nice little. This town is freaking humongous. It doesn't matter how big our numbers might get. People and Pokemon will be fine in this world. Let's go in here and check this out. Make sure I'm not missing anything. The quest for power has brought you here. Very well. Let me reward your passion with some absolutely astounding moves. They're the ultimate moves. Shall I teach them to your Pokemon? Okay, so this is... This is the guy that teaches your Pokemon, like, Blast Burn. It can only be your starters. And honestly, I don't want, to, I don't want my Charizard to have Blast Burn, so... My husband can teach ultimate moves to certain Pokemon. Yeah. Water type Pokemon, yeah. So pretty much any any of the starters can get the ultimate moves, but they're pretty. They're, they're, I don't. I don't really like them. I don't know. They're kind of cool, I guess, but just not my not my forte. So you know, should we? Let's take a picture. What is this? What is the? Uh, I always like to see the like the background of the pictures. Let's call our, our homie Phil over here. He arrives in a freaking instant, and he shall take a photo. All right. So, uh, get that little Obama snow in the background. Hold on, I'm trying to focus this shit. I'm gonna zoom like all the way back. I'm gonna snap that shit. Would you like to save this photo? Hell yeah. <laughs> That's kind of cool. Kind of sweet picture. It's gonna be kind of cool at the end of this Let's Play. I'm gonna go back and look at all the pictures I take, so it'll be kind of cool. Let me give this guy a $500 tip just because I'm a nice freaking guy. And there you go, man. You enjoy that five hundred dollars for doing nothing, but all right. So let's uh, let's go down over this way. Oh, there's an item right there. I freaking want it, but looks like I can't get can't get up there. Damn it! I oh, just gotta slide down this thing then. All right. Hello, Mr. Pokeball. It's a full restore, so that's never bad to get a free full restore. All right. What's going on. Wolfric often wanders off in the direction of the winding woods. I wonder what he's up to. I'm guessing that's the gym leader. And these look like the woods, so we're gonna go ahead and cruise up into here, Route 20, the Winding Woods. Nice. What kind of wild? Oh, holy shit! This got this is the, the Moss Rock where you can actually. I'm pretty sure if you level up an EV next to this thing, it'll turn into a Leafeon, or is that is that how it works? I, I don't know. We got a Moongus in here. What's going on, a Moongus bro? Level 49. The wild Pokemon in this place are not playing games. Let's see, who do I want? Who should I put in front? I am going to put Ballin in front, just because you're one level lower than everybody. And Alright, so I can go over there to the left. Let's check this out. A nice little berry laying on the ground, the Cassid Berry. That's very cool. And then we got a Pokeball right here, which is a Paralyzed Heal. Just getting all sorts of free shit. So that looks like that's it for this place. 
get the hell out of here, and there's gotta be another... Okay, so now we can go down. Very nice. This place is huge. Jesus. So I can either go to the left, it looks like, and I can probably also go down, so... Run away from this little wild noctowl, that's actually pretty interesting. Some powerful ass wild Pokemon in here. No wonder why the Ice type gym leader is in here. He's probably just training on all the, all the shit he's super effective against. So we can go down here and oh, run straight into a wild Pokemon. It's another freaking Noctowl. Looks like I have snow on my shirt. It's kind of funny. All right, Balm, let's run from this shit. And I'm actually I'm gonna sp I'm gonna spray a freaking repel. I cannot be bothered. With these freaking wild Pokemon anymore. My super repels are probably somewhere in here. I have so much shit in my bag nowadays. It's like I have a max repel. I'm gonna use that one. Might as well just use it to get rid of it. And that shit will last forever. So, all right, we got an item. It's a meadow plate that'll raise the type of the power of grass type moves. I'm guessing. But I'm pretty sure it is. Cool. Go over here to the left. Then it's the only other way to go. And we got a double battle. What's going on, ladies? We're gonna be the toughest twins in the world. We're gonna be the toughest. Yeah, you already you already said that. Why? Why? I don't I don't I don't understand these weird twin people. Nina, Nana, and Nina. That's kind of weird. Sweet names. So you've got uh, the little fairy duo. Okay. Ballin and Carly. Should probably switch Carly out, but Ballin can stay in here and fuck some shit up. Um, I'm gonna surf just to hit both of them, and then I'm gonna switch from Malamar into Electro. And Electra's dry skin will help out with that surf, so it'll be, it'll be pretty cool. Electra and Ballin, the ultimate double team. So, doesn't affect Electra, and surf is gonna hit both of y'all. Seems are level 53, so they're kind of beasts. <laughs> Play rough does a fuckload of damage, holy crap, now disarming voice. Ouch, Electra is hurting. Alright, so let's, uh, let's surf one more time. And Electra, you can Thunderbolt. Who, who's a bigger threat? Aromatase or Slurpluff? They're, honestly, they're both stupid. I'm, I'm gonna attack the Slurpluff, slurp though. <laughs> so, Thunderbolt, that hoe is enough to kill it. Very nice. Now, it's just this freaking Aromatase thing. Electra Gear level 54. Not too bad. Ballin's gonna surf, Electra's dry skin, it's just gonna heal some freaking some health, which is awesome. I need a skill swap. Oh shit! This motherfucker just stole my dry skin. So, <laughs> so now I can't hit you with a surf. That's actually pretty smart. What if I just didn't see that and just went for the surf again? But now I'm an ice beam. And also Thunderbolt, so you're pretty much as good as dead. So Electra's Thunderbolt is uh, gonna be enough to kill it, so. You can have my dry skin, but you shall still die. So that was pretty cool. Defeated these twins. Why do you have Pichus in your hand? Okay, those are dolls, but. I was like, where are the Pichus? I didn't I did not even freaking see them. So I'm gonna go down this way, I guess. Holy crap, this guy's just chilling in his own little area. Time to show off our Pokemon. All right. So what are you doing in this uh, like random room with a tree in the middle of it? You damn hippie. So you've got a snubble. There's freaking fairies all over the place, man. Too many fairies. So it's gonna intimidate me, which doesn't make any sense because Ballin would not be afraid of this little puppy thing, like a pink puppy. Yeah, so so intimidating. I hit you with an ice beam right to the neck just for being an asshole, and it's a one-hit kill. All right, Ballin, good shit. It's gonna be enough to grow on to level 53. Sweet. Next is a Grand Bull. Well then. See, Grand Bull is at least a little bit more intimidating. Look at this guy. Doesn't even have Intimidate either. You got it all mixed up. It's gonna hit you with you an ice cream, so yeah, you handle it. Oh yeah, I got that freeze. <laughs> That's funny. Well, it sucks to be you. Ramble. Oh, I shall Thunderbolt you just because why the hell not? And you are dead. So 
Slime Shady grew to level 53, like a boss. I can't stop, can't stop teeing because all, because of the sight of your Pokemon. Really tickles me. What the fuck? <laughs> this lady, I told you this lady was high. She damn hippie out here in the, in the wilderness. I don't understand. What, what is this room? There's nothing here. Can I like headbutt this tree? Well then, I'm gonna go ahead and get the hell out of here. And uh, go up this way. Ooh, there's a TM right there. Hey, battle me, little girl. You just ran into a girl who's head over heels for Pokemon battles. You're a little too young to be wearing heels. Young lady. Fairy tale girl. Has a Klefki. See, there's, there's nothing but fairies in this place. <laughs> what the hell? Freaking Klefki. Weirdest Pokemon of all time. I just ice beamed it on accident, but whatever. Play rough, avoided it? Alright. I'm gonna surf you. Magic room. What the hell is that? Created a bizarre area. Okay. That's, that's cool. You go ahead and hit your uh, keychain with a surf. And one more is gonna do the trick. Faster than your ass. So your cleft key is dead. Very nice. So next is Azumarill. Alright. Yet another fairy. So luckily I put Thunderbolt on this Lapras. It definitely helps out. Hit this bitch with a Thunderbolt. It's gonna do a lot of damage. Almost easy easy to hit kill. This thing has superpower fuck my life. I was afraid of that, but it, you know, Fallen's like, I'm a freaking monster. I ain't afraid of your your Azumarill. That did not do as much as I even thought. Holy shit. Maybe this thing doesn't have huge power or something. I don't know. Maybe your Azumarill is just a bitch. Well, give it one more Thunderbolt. That's going to kill it. Dick Pinch grew to level 56. Holy crap. Girls in love don't mind if they lose. Are you in love then? Well, so I can go over there to the right. And it looks like there is also... Holy shit, there are just too many options. I'm going to go down then. Is my repel wore off? I can, I can just keep going down with this? What the hell is this? Where the fuck am I? Holy crap. Looks like I've made it I made it into the Pokemon village, but do I want to go here yet? Whatever. What's going on? I'm guessing this is the gym leader. You just scared I just scared all the wild Pokemon away. You know what this place is? Welcome to the Pokemon Village. This place is a secret, you know. Most of the Pokemon here are runaways to escape from bad people who did awful things to them. It's a shame how many heartless trainers can't bother to care for the Pokemon are out there. Some of these Pokemon, though, some of them are just too strong. And found they didn't really have a place in the outside world, so they came here. Hmm, I see. Your Pokemon sure seem to think highly of you. You've had some good times together, haven't you? Hey, you can all come out now. This one's alright. And they all just, like, emerge. <laughs> That's funny. Sometimes I get worried and come here to check on everyone. Oh, excuse my manners. We haven't even had a proper introduction yet. My name's Wolfric. I'm usually over at the gym in Snowbell City. Since I'm the gym leader and all, let me guess, you want to challenge me? That's right. I thought so. Sorry to inconvenience you like this. I'll be waiting for you back at the gym then. Before I come by, I think it would be it would do you good to spend some time with the Pokemon here. Well, all right then. I'll, I'll do that. What's going on, little Pokemon? The Pokemon has something in its mouth. Obtained a pretty wing. Well, thanks, you little fletchling. Stole your pretty wing, but whatever. What's, what's this thing? Fwa. Well, just found a wild Pokemon by freaking turning around in the grass. And it's another Noctowl. So why is this Noctowl hidden, but all the other Pokemon around here are just sitting out for everybody to freaking see? I feel like ice beaming this thing. Level 50 Noctowls is probably going to give you so much experience. It probably wouldn't be a bad idea to train in this place. It's already how much experience I could get, like, pretty easily. But, you know, training's for squares, so fuck that. I kill one Noctowl, call it a day. <laughs> See you later, Noctowl. Carly grew to level 55. Nice. Alright, so let's check this place out a little bit. Got like grass everywhere that I keep freaking finding wild Pokemon in, damn it. It's another Amoongus. What's up, little Amoongus guy? 
get the hell out of here. Alright, go ahead and avoid the freaking wild Pokemon. What is what is that? That cave looks important. I need to get in there. It will be my lifelong goal to get in that cave. What the hell's going on? A Snorlax lies deep in slumber. It looks like it's having some good dreams. What holy shit this <laughs> Snorlax is just hanging out under here. Oh my god, that's awesome. Why can't I use my why can't I catch you though? I need a Poke Flute so bad. Alright guys, we're gonna end the episode here. So uh, next time we're gonna head back to Snowbell City. I'm actually probably gonna explore a little bit more in the uh, in the forest before we do that, but we're gonna battle the gym leader and it's gonna be sweet, so I'll see you guys later.